This thing. This thing. Come, come back around here. You gotta check this out. So that- Custom made? I made that myself. So when wow. I moved here to Nashville, right before I moved, I knew that I was gonna end up in an apartment and I knew that I couldn't stop playing guitar, and I knew that I didn't, uh, keep in mind, this was like 2014. Okay. So like, direct and amp simulators was not where they are now. Yeah. And so, my thought was I have to build an ISO cab that fits through the door of a bedroom apartment that is the quietest thing anyone's ever heard. Inside this is, it's a two cabinet design, and Basically, it is by an enormous percentage the quietest ISO cab. You can't buy one any quieter, that's for sure. So it's Whoa. it's over 65 dB deadening. Oh my god! Ugh. And so, make sure I don't knock those over. Whoa! Okay, so it's suspended. Yeah. So this is completely suspended on rubber straps. John is loving this. And then, <laughs> and then inside of that. Oh yeah. So basically what I did is I was like, how big of a cabinet can I make yeah. while suspending it, while still fitting the outside through a door? So this is 12 ply birch, tons of treatment, Bayer Dynamic M201 and Arroyo R121, Ooh. whole rack of Weber speakers. And then it's suspended on rubber straps with a bunch of insulation in here. And then the cabinet itself is made out of uh, three quarter inch plywood, green glue, five eighths drywall, green glue, three quarter inch plywood, and then Fender style Tolex over the top of it. And it's like, I'll turn those amps all the way up and you can barely hear it. It's crazy. Yeah, the suspended air floating thing, mm -hmm. that is amazing. And so then when we moved here, I don't need it anymore necessarily now that I'm in this studio. Yeah. But the best sounding guitars I've ever done in my whole career have come out of this box. Mm. So I'm like, I'm just gonna keep using it. That's so awesome. How do you plug into it? There's like uh, a there's little... cables right down on that side. There's a couple XLRs and a speaker cable. Yeah. Jacks that are all epoxied in so that way the least amount of sound escapes as possible.